Ariel Hawani post-fight at UFC 158 alongside Jake Ellenberger, who knocked out Nate Marquardt tonight in the very first round. And Jake, it's amazing because we had a conference call last week. We had a press conference this week. Those two lasted, what, like 90 minutes or so combined? You weren't asked one question leading up to this. You made a statement tonight. Was that part of what you were trying to do? Uh, you know, it's kind of been part of the plan the whole time, though, really, for me. Um, I know coming up, this is a big venue, big card, and I really just wanted to to put a stamp on in this fight um, and move forward. You know, I've been focusing so much on, on just getting better each fight and getting faster and, uh, you know, um, he came out, came out on top. You know, Nate is not the kind of guy who gets finished like that. Did you believe that you could finish him going into this fight? Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, and it's not, it, I, I've always been confident, you know what I mean? I, um, I have some of the best coaches in the world and I, I, just, I just know that I can beat anybody in the world. So, um, you know, I was feeling good the whole, the whole night and uh, like I said, I, I think I can, yeah, I, can, I think I can finish anybody in the world. How'd you finish him? Explain it to us. Yeah, uh, with Nate, you know, I, I just really controlling the range. Really, with something we worked on a lot is controlling that distance and range, um, coming in, you know, slipping, you know, moving my head a lot more, and just really landing those power punches when, uh, when he when you start getting him flat footed. You know, he st he stood square. Something we looked we look for him his square stance, and, and you know, we landed some power. Did it bother you that you were being ignored so much going into this fight? Well, I didn't think I was being ignored. Apparently, you did. But well, no one asked you a question. Uh, you know, well, it's, you know, Nick Diaz and, and GSP. I mean, that's, I, I, which I'm a fan of both guys. So, you know, um, no, it didn't, didn't bother me at all. You know what I mean? Like, at the end of the day, uh, I'm just here to fight. You know what I mean? So I'm excited to, I was excited to get in here and, and just compete and really put a stamp on, on the fight. How many fights away do you think, or wins away, do you think you are from a title shot? Uh, one. One fight. Just one after this, of course. Yep. Yep, one fight, and then hopefully we get the, the title fight. And obviously we're talking to you in the middle of the card, so it's hard to say what's next, but yeah. are you confident you'll get that one big fight that you need to, to get the title shot? Uh, I'm, I do, I do. I think, um, you know, it went is exactly, you know, I, I couldn't have planned it better the way the fight went tonight, so um, hopefully uh, we get, like, you know, one of the guys tonight that's fighting, you know, we'll see, but um, hopefully no more contender fight. All right, congrats on the win. Thanks, Errol.